Yeah, Watt out with that yellow card, so Papadopoulos will replace him. Daniel Shannon's got to be careful coming out this far. That ball could have been sent, and as he's out of position, and it's a goal. And that is a big mistake by Daniel Shannon, and the goal is going to go to number 22, Tyler Harry. Senior midfielder from Perry Hall, Maryland. And Maddie, as we take another look, Daniel Shannon out of position. Just way out of place there comes. I think he thinks that he, I think he thought that he could get to that ball before Hay Haynag got there, but. With a chance off the turnover, floats one in, Faze with a chance to settle it. What a shot. Boy, the crowd liked it too. Going down the wing here and a great service from him. Faze just controls that and. Sends that one really far to lock Sand. Heads it. That's it. It's a goal and number two on the night for UMBC. Lasse Kelp. The sophomore defender. And UMBC very excited with a little celebration on the side. And he won't, but he's down 2 nothing in the 70th minute here, Maddie. As he floats it over the head of Daniel Shannon. We take another look. It was a great cross here and an initial great look but a good defensive header from Diaz but I think Shannon just didn't read that that was going into the goal. Thielman whips that one towards Lopez who's Janssen. Hey it's Sheck right on goal. Nothing comes of it for the Great Danes. Five, four, three, two, one. And UMBC hangs on late as you already had life at the uh, at the end there. As uh, it was a good one here tonight, UMBC off to an undefeated start in conference play. Great Danes lose their first game at home.